Hello, Brian Reed here with Firewalls.com. In this video, we're going to show you how to use a sonic wall firewall to block UltraSurf. UltraSurf is a common application that people will use to bypass local firewalls and content filtering devices to access websites on the internet that they wouldn't be able to otherwise. This is accomplished by using the built-in web application firewall within the sonic wall. Let me demonstrate how to perform this action within the admin console of the sonic wall. First we go to firewall, match objects, add new match object. What we're going to do here is we're going to train the sonic wall how to identify the ultra surf application. So for the name, we'll just go ahead and type in UltraSurf. Match object type. We'll scroll down and select application list. For the category, it's going to be proxy access. And for the application, we're going to select encrypted. We'll select add and then go ahead and select OK. So now we've told the sonic wall how to identify the UltraSurf application. Now we want to create a rule and tell the firewall what it should do when it comes across this object. So we'll go to App Rules and select Add New Policy. So for the policy name, we'll just put in uh, Block UltraSurf. And for the policy type, it's going to be App Control Content. Address, we're going to leave it any because we want to apply this to uh, any addresses. We're not going to exclude any addresses. The match object, it pulls up the UltraSurf, which is what we created under the uh, the match object there just a minute ago. And now we tell it what we want the firewall to do when it finds this. So let's go ahead and just reset and drop that connection. And we're going to apply it to all users and all groups. We're going to leave it scheduled always on so it blocks it day or night, weekends, whenever. We'll go ahead and make sure that logging is enabled so that we can see that in the logs and we know which users on the local network is uh, using the app application or at least has it installed. And zone, we're going to go ahead and just apply it to all zones, whether it's wireless users, network users, and so on. Then we select OK. So as you can see, now we have our application rule policy in place where it's going to block the ultra surf it's actually going to reset the connection so that it can't connect to their servers to make the the connection so to demonstrate I'm going to go ahead and just disable this rule for right now and I'm going to go ahead and open up ultra surf and as we can see it's already uh, made the connection it's gone green and it's successfully connected to the server. So let's go ahead and exit that. Now we're going to go ahead and enable our rule. And we will open up UltraSurf again. And as you can see, the application is stuck, trying its uh, unique port the status is connecting server and you can also see that this is uh, UltraSurf version 10.03 uh, which at the time of this video is the latest and greatest version that uh, they have out there but I'm fairly confident that even if they come out with newer versions the uh, application firewall that we created within the SonicWell firewall will still prevent that okay and that's how you use a sonic wall firewall to block the UltraSurf application. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please enter them in the section below. All right, we hope you found this useful. Take care.